Hello friends. I welcome you all to TechMind. I hope you all are doing well. Most of us know how to control tasks on our computer using our mouse, but there's a much faster way. Windows 11 keyboard shortcuts make things happen with just a tap on the keyboard. Here are shortcuts for everything, from taking a screenshot to controlling your taskbar. While some Windows shortcuts have been around, as long as Microsoft Windows, some are new and exclusive to Windows 11. Here's what they are, and how to use them. Scroll programs. Start off with an easy one. Sometimes, you have several programs open at the same time. To easily scroll through those programs, hold down the Alt plus Tab key at the same time, and then keep pressing the Tab key with Alt key held down until you find the program you are looking for, and then let go off both keys. Minimize a program. If you are in a program and you want to see your desktop, holding down the Windows key plus D will minimize your open windows, showing your desktop. Holding down Windows key plus D again will bring your open window back in view. Capture a part of screen. Many of you are familiar with a snipping tool built into Windows that allows for capturing a part of your screen. A quicker way to take a snippet with the latest version of Windows 11 is to hold down the Windows key plus Shift plus S. You'll see the cursor is replaced with the plus icon. Now just left click on your mouse and select the portion of the screen that you would like to capture and then let go. It will automatically create a copy to your clipboard, but to save this capture, you'll need to paste it into one of your image editing programs. Rename a file. If you simply want to rename a file without selecting it with your mouse, use your arrow keys to move over to the file, then tap the F2 key, then rename your file and press Enter key. Snapping Windows. Snapping Windows is great if you like to multitask. Let's say you want to watch or listen to a YouTube video while working on another project. So, let's take this YouTube window, hold down the Windows key, and then tap on the left or right arrow key to move your window into place, then use the same shortcut to move the other window into place for side-by-side -side viewing. Capture an active window. I already showed you earlier how to capture a snippet, and most of you know that using the Windows key plus print screen key on your keyboard will capture the entire desktop, but if you want to capture the active window you have opened, without capturing the rest of the desktop, hold down Alt plus the print screen key, it will automatically be saved to your C drive. Open setting. Instead of going to the start menu to open settings, holding down the Windows key plus I will open the settings menu. Open action center panel. Using the Windows key plus A will open the action center panel, with the panel open I'll give you a bonus tip. Use the Tab key to jump down to the Control section, and then use the arrow keys to navigate this panel, and with Wi-Fi outlined in white, I'll hit the Enter key on my keyboard to turn it on. You can navigate other windows on your computer in the same way as well. Virtual Desktops A feature added with the launch of Windows 11 is Virtual Desktops, which is great if you keep a lot of apps open, or you use your PC for different types of tasks. To see your virtual desktops, Hold down the Windows key and the Tab key, you'll see at the bottom of the screen that I have two desktop environments that are currently open. To create a new virtual desktop, hold down the Windows key plus Ctrl key plus D, now with three virtual desktops currently active. To switch between these desktops, hold down the Windows key plus Ctrl key, and then press either the left or right arrow. Copy of a file. If you want to quickly make a copy of a file without using Ctrl-C to copy and Ctrl-V to paste, this one actually involves the use of your mouse. Highlight the file, hold down the Ctrl key, and drag the file outward. That's what I call quick copy and paste. Don't forget to subscribe, like, comment, and share. Thanks.